Hi, Tom Anderson, B40 of 100 Days of Thankfulness. Today we're talking about the importance of family, and also I want to talk about why I'm so thankful for my sister, Jane Anderson. Um, so family is hugely important. Uh, no one ever looks at you know back on their life when they're about to die and says, if only I had spent just a few more hours at the office. Um, it, often what they say is, I wish I had spent more time with my kids, or I wish I had spent more time with uh, my family. And the reason they say that is because it's often at the end of our life that we get the most wisdom and we realize just how precious those moments are, especially the, those moments with our family. Um, as a parent of seven boys, I you know, see my boys growing up just so fast. You know, my youngest, Dylan, is now four years old. And I, you know, especially with having so many kids, I just wish I could spend more time with, you know, even each one of them, uh, just spending time with them, you know, even just by themselves. Um, but that's, um, you know, that's life, right? You know, we, at the same time that we're, you know, wanting to spend those enjoyable moments with our family, we have, you know, the, the normal pressures of life that come upon us. Um, but it's, you know, despite all those pressures, it's so important to take the effort to um, find that time to spend with your family. Now, um, my family growing up, I already talked about my mom and my dad and my younger brother, Charlie. Um, want to share a bit about my oldest sister, Jane. Uh, so she called me today and um, she also very much has this same, same appreciation for um, the importance of family. Actually, you know, both, both my sisters very much so. Jen actually got together with Charlie just because she hadn't seen him in a while and um, she was talking to Jane and Jane said, oh yeah, I'm getting together with Tom. And they came up with kind of a plan, hey, let's just all of us get together because we really haven't done that. Normally we only see each other during the holidays. And I, you know, I thought that was great. So actually, instead of us getting together today, we're going to be getting together, um, you know, me, my brother, and my two sisters on Wednesday. And we haven't done that, you know, um, in a really long time. So <clears throat> um, that just goes to show, you know, to, you know, the, the heart of my sister, Jane. Now, Jane is someone that normally when we get together, uh, time just flies, you know, we'll, we'll sit and talk with each other for hours and then we'll both be surprised at what time it is and like, oh, I'm late for something. Um, for example, last time she was here, uh, you know, she was just dropping something off and then, um, you know, we, we were talking and I was walking her out to her car and then we ended up talking for well over an hour in the driveway <laughs> just about different things. You know, we, we have some common interests. Um, we're both very much into nutrition. Um, we're, we're both um, very much into family and children and, and that sort of thing. Um, and, you know, the other thing that's really interesting um, about each other, you know, Jane and I, is we both grew up uh, with similar belief systems. Um, you know, I talked about how I was um, growing up, I was more into like the new age stuff and, and Jane is as well. And so um, even though we've diverged in our belief systems as adults, um, I, I can certainly understand where she's coming from um, and it helps with our ability to communicate with each other. Um, and, you know, it, it helps for me to just see, you know, understand, like when she talks about, you know, how she loves to knit, right? She, she feels this sense of peace while she knits, you know, she can be doing lots of other things. She can be having a conversation and she'll just be knitting while she does it. And she just feels this sense of peace. Well, I'm not a knitter, but um, I have kind of the same experience with um, when I work, you know, on my aquariums, when I'm maintaining my reef aquariums, um, or also my experience uh, first time scuba diving was just this, you know, sense of peace. You know, when I'm 
um, for whatever reason, and, and maybe it relates to, you know, when I was in kindergarten and wanting to be a marine biologist, um, I, I'm just fascinated by that. And to be able to just spend time, it's, I, I'm sort of the same way. I can be working on my aquarium and having a conversation and, and doing other things at the same time. Um, but it, it gives me a sense of peace. And so we have, we have that in common. Um, but, you know, I think it's part of the reason why our conversations go on so long is we, have, we each have a genuine interest for each other. Um, and I think we both also are very sensitive towards, um, you know, towards other people, but also sensitive in, in the sense that we both have this um, strong desire to make a positive impact on the world. Um, you know, I've shared a bit about, you know, how I want to help uh, people, w you know, with their nutrition and whatnot. And obviously I want people to know Jesus. Um, Jane, uh, she, well, it goes back to like a lot of her knitting. She's um, helping a charity called Bundles of Love, where what they do is they knit um, blankets and clothing for newborns. Um, that you know for families that are in need and they put together these these neat bundles and then they um, They donate them for these these newborn babies. Um, so I'll provide a link for that um, But I, I think it's just you know Jane and I we each have a deep appreciation for what each other's lives are like and we're just we're we're simply interested in each other's lives, and that's why the conversations go on so, so long. Um, so, you know, I, I guess I don't really have anything else to add to that other than to say, you know, if you haven't seen your family for a while, or maybe even if you um, are part of the reason you haven't seen your family for a while is because you have different beliefs or there's some sort of friction that's causing that. Um, I've already talked about forgiveness, so. Hopefully you've you've watched that, and hopefully there's there's no resentment between you and your family. Um, but it's just it's so important to uh, make the effort uh, to reconnect on a regular basis with your family. Uh, so with that, thanks again to my sister Jane Anderson.